Junior Senior. G'day YouTubers, it's Senior here from Junior Senior Gaming and today we're continuing along with uh, starting from scratch series and we're actually going from, now we are, let's see, well the actual, let's go over here and have a look. Um, so yeah, we are going from Javaska in Finland to Rouen. Okay, and we are carrying some tableware. Now that was actually in, uh, we've done two episodes before this and we, we actually had a look. Now let's go to the actual world, mark, uh, world map. It's a bit tongue tied today. Um, we are currently in Malmo where we pulled over to get a bit of a rest. And we're now going to continue along and go down. We need to go down all the way down to Rouen, see? And there it is, right there. So we still got a fair way to go. Now this job worth $75,000 is really going to give us a nice big boost along, so... Uh, or 70, well, 71,000, sorry. So let's see if we can continue on, not have any issues, and that way we can have... get ourselves, uh, you know, that nice big... Uh, got some handbrake on. To get that uh, three bay uh, garage. Now let's turn the sound down. That is a little bit loud. There we go. Now let's see, we're coming out of here. Now, just turning around here and we should be able to get out. Now I have been driving the K200, so I'm used to that at the moment, and we'll see how we go getting back into this. Because as you'd know, uh, as I've said, that uh, this, I always mostly do these uh, uh, series, they're starting from scratch, uh, pre-recorded. And that way it makes it a lot easier for me to have like spare videos and stuff like that. So it gives these guys a bit of stuff to watch, so. Because otherwise, if um, I don't have stuff for you to watch, then people get very upset. <laughs> right, uh, going to, whoops, stick it in first. Actually, we'll pop it into second. There we go. Now, nicely around here. I love driving this truck and I think that this truck was an awesome selection for the first truck from the starting from scratch series. And a lot of people got disappointed and they wanted the Scania but well I have to you know I have to say that uh, really have to go with what people want to see so. Oh that's a red, doesn't matter. It's only slightly red. And we didn't get penalised for it, so... No penalty, no foul. Right. Nice... Oh, get off the gutter. Always driving up the gutter. This is, um, yeah, Malmo looks very quiet. It's like I'm in multiplayer and there's uh, no one else around. That's what it looks like at the moment. Speaking of multiplayer, don't forget to catch up with the actual convoy. Uh, won't be any more by the time you see this, though. There won't be any more for this year, but... Uh, there will, however, be some more coming next year in 2016. I'm trying to get this round that I've hit something, but anyway. It's tight European roads. But, um, yeah, don't... Uh, they will be coming 2016. I'm not really figured out when I want to do them yet, but um, I will be doing them. It'll be early, early January, 
but uh, the exact date I've not yet thought about. So I just want to have some time uh, doing some stuff that I want to do for a bit, and then we'll get back right into that. I know a lot of people are very keen. So um, over the Christmas break, we'll be watching a lot of Euro trucks and uh, playing a lot of Euro trucks. And if you see me on multiplayer on uh, over the Christmas break, then be sure to say hi. Because yeah, I'll be on there playing a bit of multiplayer. Oops. Because I love playing Euro trucks. And uh, yeah, so uh, we might be able to even do a mini convoy. Well, I want to go and do some convoys on my holidays as well make sure that um, you know that I get to, I want to see some bigger convoys so I got my eye out at the moment for some big convoys so I can learn how they do their convoys because at the moment we've been confronted with rather large crowds with the convoys and we're trying our utmost best to get in there and do the convoy to how we know how to do it how we can figure out how to do it but um, it may not be the best to other up to standard with other other you know groups that do convoys. So, but anyway, we're trying. We're really trying to do it as best we can. All right, here's a toll, and uh, it, is it a fast pass? Yes, it is. Hundred and seventy two pounds of highway robbery. Oh no, that's just forming into one lane. Oh look at this. Beautiful bridge. What a shame it's dark. It really is a shame. But anyway. We might take a photo anyway. I love taking photos. You know what I really do love? I love this starting from scratch series because I can play, you know, the game, have a lot of fun like, you know, I did back when I first started, like I still do have a lot of fun. But the thing is, is I can do it with you guys as well. And that's what I really enjoy. And um, I think it's, it's really, I should have done this a lot I should have done this a couple of years ago when the game first came out. Look at that. That is very nice. Hang on. Why are we stuck on there? Stuck on something? No, oh, it's the end of the area. So, see if we can get the field of view a bit sort of... Don't want to warp it too much. That's the thing. There we go. Look at that. That's beautiful. So nice. Really do, I really do love the uh, the views that we can actually get here in the game. So nice. Look at that. Brilliant. Alright. Back in and... Now, what are we meant to be doing? We're meant to be doing 50. And uh, we're st as we're in patch 1.22, you won't hear the actual banana break or the Jake break. Because uh, exhaust break... You can call it whatever you like. We're calling it banana break. Um, because they have not fixed that yet. So hopefully by the time you see this video, they would have fixed that. Look at the reflections that we have here. On that wood grain and... You know, on the steering wheel there. That looks so nice. Really does look nice. And um, I actually, I, I've actually think I know this truck was uh, was given to me, guys. But I think that uh, it's my own opinion, though, my own personal choice, that this is definitely worth the the money that was you know spent on it. I mean, I know it's a bit hard now that the Australian dollar's taken a bit of a, uh, a slide, um, yeah, because it's almost worth fifty dollars now. I think it's forty-five dollars that this is Australian, and that's a bit harsh bit harsh for a mod and I know a lot of people are going to refuse to pay for this uh, but but yeah it's 
I think it's worth it. I've had so much fun with this, so much time I've spent driving this um, this truck, and I've seen a lot of people, well, a few people that have actually said they would never pay for this, or they've never actually, you know, would never drive it or whatever, but once they've actually tried it and they've had a go, they've changed their mind. I'm not mentioning any names, but there's a couple of YouTubers who have done that as well, so... Um, and originally I was saying that I wasn't going to do it, but, you know, I changed my mind. But you can change your mind, it's all good. Doesn't mean you're a girl or anything like that. So what? But, uh, anyway, it's all good. But, um, oh, that's it, get around there. But yeah, so, uh, the Christmas break. I hope a lot of you are having a wonderful time over Christmas. I know I am. I'm having a wonderful time. And, um, yeah, we'll still be bringing the videos to you, just we've had taken a break with the series and all that, so a few of the series. But this one here starting from scratch series I think it's one that I can do pretty much any time that I feel like doing it and I like that we we did do it uh, sorry itchy nose there we did do it live for a while and uh, you know that was good but there's other things that you can do as well like um, the driving scan your scan your driving school that seems to be going quite well on YouTube and on Twitch so that was better than what I thought it would go but uh, and if you haven't checked those videos out then make sure you do jump in and check those out guys ah oh, wonderful views yeah you know, I still keep trying to put my arm out the, the actual window of the truck <laughs> oh, such it's it's bad, it really is, because I do that in real life, put my arm out the window of the truck while I'm driving along. But it's got a little um, little bar thing that sits there. It's a, it's a Hino that I drive. And it's got a, um, a bar that sits there that you can rest your arm on. You can have the window closed with the air conditioning on and you just rest your arm there. Oh, here we go. Makes for some more good photos. Always water. Always makes for good photos. Stop it. Let's take some photos. Got to take some photos. It's, um, I'm keen to see when they're actually going to be bringing out the rest of this, this mod, the actual 1.22 patch. It can't be too far away because... You know, it's unless they're having just a lot of trouble with the the few things like the Jake and the exhaust brake, banana brake, sorry. Um, that might be a bit of a real issue for them at the moment because I haven't heard much about that and that would have been something I thought would have been easy to fix, but obviously it's not. Well, that is interesting. So when they actually do bring fix you know fix up the patch I was hoping they would have done it by Christmas and hopefully by the time that you've seen this it will have already been out so Now I've been told that this bridge in real life is actually a lot bigger than what it is portrayed here in the game but that's fair enough I mean it's it's good that they do portray it in the game but uh they could not, no way, do it the proper size, really. It would just be too much. Man, this is awesome. This is the life, driving around in a truck. You know, looking at the sights. You know, I think this is great. Just on the, on the highway, pedal to the metal. Just looking at the scenery as it goes by. Very relaxing. But uh, I know that a lot of lot of truckers out there, they have, their job is very hard because they've got a deadlines and stuff like that. So, 
Except for the guys, the company that I work for, it's not so bad. <laughs> They're pretty relaxed. <laughs> Uh, no, I'm not telling you the company. Before anyone asks, I'm not telling you the company I work for. They don't want to know. They don't want to have any association with me. Which is good. I don't want to have any association with them either. Uh, we're moving a bit slow here. I would like to pick up the pace. We're on the uh, freeway. It says 43 miles per hour. You know, which is a bit, bit dodgy. I'd rather be going faster. Hey, mate, how's it going? Can't merge properly. You're a tool. That's what. That's what I'd scream out the window. <laughs> uh, actually, you shouldn't really be screaming out the window. Um, because a lot of people get road rage here been, been lately because uh, as many of you know I, I live in Brisbane and we've been having a fair bit of road rage incidents around now people just chill out serious just let it go if somebody yells at you just let it go don't worry about it you're not gonna you're not gonna win anything you're not gonna win a prize if you jump out and flog them with a the tire iron um, so, you know, it's not like whack-a-mole or anything, you know, it doesn't give up a prize, so don't bother, just let it go. You know, there's, there's, like, there was a dude that was about, oh, I think three weeks ago, got into a punch-up on the side of the road. That's intense, serious. It was like, and then one guy got pushed into oncoming traffic. So that was, that was pretty pretty bad right here we are at the seaport now um, that roof looks a little bit low so I hope we're gonna make it through there anyway I don't think the game had let it would um, bother us too much if we didn't anyway Right, now we're going across into the, on the ferry. In the wrong gear again. Oh, senior. Terrible. Terrible. Right. Handbrake on and then the actual turn the truck off this time. And then we need to go over to the other side. So, we are going over to Put Garden. Arrival in Put Garden in 45 minutes. Let's go embark. 290 pounds. Man, these ferry people are making a killing. Making a killing like a villain. They really are. Okay, so let's get our truck on the road again. Handbrake off. And into fourth gear. And away we go. Berg a Furman. Furman, whatever it is. And there's all the people waiting to get on. And through the toll thing or whatever it is. Oh, come on. What did we hit? This is what drives me nuts. Are we meant to go through this part or what? Let's jump out and have a look. Ah, oh, see the top hit. We hit the top. Oh dear. Look at that. That's what we hit. So back it out. We just wrecked our truck. And we're just gonna back it up and then go out the, around the long way if we can. Yeah, around the long way. Oops, sorry. Did we do any damage? Oh, look, the load's damaged 5% and we got 1%. Uh, we're in a bad spot. We've gone and wrecked the load now. Nuts. Well, let's try not to wreck it anymore, shall we? Right. 
really need to get that that uh, other that that garage so we can get another. Ah, oh, got it in the wrong gear. That's what's happening. Short messages. I don't want messages. Get out of there. I want that. That's what I want up. Hamburg! Hamburger! And away we go. Now, it's 37, so... Don't you turn. I thought he was going to turn then. Another awesome bridge. Really do like these bridges. Whoops, going a bit over there. Whoops, there we go. Finally got it. I nearly got the wrong gear there and we would have had an accident. <laughs> like that time in the K200 when I was doing YouTube Live and I sped off into the ditch because <laughs> I hit the wrong gear. <laughs> oh man, that was funny. Uh, oh, 37 we're meant to be doing. Through construction site. So, there is meant to be... Is that traffic lights up here? No. No, oh, they're building the freeway. That's what it is. Building the highway. Yay! Let's go! 50 miles per hour. Yeah, look at that, that's nice. Actually, that this area here reminds me of Australia. So, there's 43, need to be doing 50. And, no, we're going straight through. I thought we were turning for a second there. There's a truck going slower up here. Can we get around him? Cars whizzing past so fast. Let's try now. Put put the foot down and let the oh no, this guy's gonna pull in front, watch this. No he's not. Whoa. Saw that truck wiggle towards me then. I, I was actually driving um, to work one day in my car and I had some guy in a BMW, I don't know what he was doing but I was just driving along and all of a sudden he came, started coming into my lane before I knew it he was kept going and going and I'm going oh my god and I had to sort of started to I sort of got shocked and, and jolted over and then uh, didn't go into the other lane but this guy went halfway into my lane before he actually realised that he was that he'd actually gone over there 
I'm like, what an idiot. He's probably texting or something. Alright, what are you doing, bozo? Get out of the road. Oh, come on. Serious? You really did that, didn't you? Man, he nearly became a hood ornament. Osfart, welcome to Osfart. And now, back up to 50 if we can. Oh, don't you dare pull out in front. Ooh, I got my eye on you, pal. Crazy AI in this game. Drive you nuts. And oh oh geez. Oh oh hang on. Oh 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 this guy's stopping. Everyone's stopping all of an, all of a sudden. Oh man. That would have been dangerous. See, I can't get used to these European roads where they just, you know, you get two lanes that are just going off out of nowhere. They don't stop and make two new lanes to go off. No, they just make split the whole lot off. It's like crazy. I think it's crazy anyway. Let's see, can we see over the bonnet? Yeah. Oh, I gotta get that back down to 50. Whoops, I hit the horn by accident. Come on, these cars that keep pulling in front of me is making me nervous. Oops, I'm jumping over too many lanes. Nice cruise now, back into cruise mode. See, I need a big giant spiky bull bar so I can ram these cars in front that pull in front all the time. But this AI is, reminds me so much of people, how they really drive on the road. It's crazy. It really is. Alright, so we need to find a resting stop. We're not uh, overly tired, but we could use a rest. And we need to stop the video there anyway, so... Let's see, what do we got? Osnabrück, I think that was. And who knows, whereabouts there is a stop, somewhere up here somewhere, there'll be one. And what, I just realised there's a sign back there, here comes another one. What does this sign say, does it say trucks 100? It say trucks 100 and it says something else. Is it, yeah, see there's trucks, okay, well, there's trucks and cars right next to each other there, I don't know what that means. Uh, there's a rest stop coming up, so we want to jump in this lane here. And it'll be showing up on the map very soon, I'm sure. I think cars are allowed to do 120 and trucks have to do 100. 
I don't know. Oh, there it is. There's the rest stop just up there. So we'll pull into that. Hopefully we can get some fuel. Yes, we can. We need some fuel. And then we get some rest as well. And it all will be good. Right. I like these truck stops. But they're only small, they're not very big truck stops. Right, so here we go. And we'll turn the engine off. The handbrake on. And then we'll fill her up. How much is this going to take to fill up? Let's see. Oh, 449. It's not a very big tank, is it? 98, nine, uh, 98 gallons. So It's not a very big tank. Right. Uh, let's, let's go forward. And we will get some rest. And we'll just park over here. And there we go. That is pretty much it. So we will park there. So stop the engine. Handbrake on. Stop the engine. And let's get some rest. And that will pretty much be it, guys. So rest there we go and we will come back very soon so this is where we are on the map just have a quick look while we're here on the map see where we are so we are at Bremen see so about uh, we're about halfway are we it's over halfway now we're over halfway and yeah we've got probably another one two more episodes to go I'd say We'll, we'll see how we go. Don't know. But anyway, that is pretty much it for this episode, guys. Uh, look, thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, then don't forget to share and give us a thumbs up. And, uh, yeah, look, I hope you're having a wonderful time at Christmas. Uh, as, uh, you know, we're having a little bit of a break, but um, still cranking out the videos. But, look, thank you very much, guys, for watching. Keep the shiny side up and the greasy side down. And I'm 1010 on the side. And remember, game on! Thanks for watching YouTubers, if you'd like to see more videos, then click on the links beside. Just over here we take a look at the Kenworth K200 and we're doing some world of truck contracts. Just down there we're on spin tyres and we're trying to conquer the hill. We haven't done it in the past, but can we do it this time? If you'd like to visit our website or you'd like to subscribe, then click on the links below. If you like this video, then don't forget to share. Thanks again for watching YouTubers and remember, GAME ON!